my god, this map is huge! I don't even- Oh my lord, is this like- This- the mini-map is actually almost worthless. My god, it's so big. There's like 14 watchtowers. What is even happening? Wow, information overload. <laughs> no rush? <laughs> yeah, no rush 20 seconds. I'm with Meditor on that one. Uh, this map might be too big. This map might be too big. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> okay, so is that, that looks like it's destructible rocks back there. So, all right, so you come down here and then you get like a, a, a fourth base and there's like a gold base up here. Oh my God, there's a double, double rich gas gold base. Oh my Lord, I want that. I want that so badly. <laughs> I'm like, okay, I actually wish I went hatch first there. I'm going to take my third there real early and just see if we can get straight up into it. Yeah, this could be awesome. Okay. Oh, all right. So I think this is going to be a Protoss player. And I guess we're just going to just queue my overlords around the map a bit. All right. A bit overwhelming. <laughs> um, it kind of feels like, um, kind of feels like, uh, 4v4 mega random on AoE 2. <laughs> you just look at the map and you're instantly like, oh my lord, there is a lot going on here, you know? It's <laughs> For anyone who's ever played mega random in AoE 2 is like the craziest map. I love that they put that shit on the ladder in AoE as well. Where you're just like, wait, what? You, you're putting a map that literally is completely random. Like you can you can start off with like any number of workers. It's like different every game. You, you, you know, it's it's crazy. All right, so we've got Metators up here. No worries. Um, let's get that gold base. Mate. Oh, you're gonna pay for that. Oh, Overlord survives. So many different things going on. Oh, he gets it? You little shithead. Okay. Wait, Santa Claus already died? What? How? How did... How? What the heck? Get that creep connecting the base. Alright, so Ling Speed's here. Elmo's left nut? How are two players already dead? Guys, you've got so much space. I, I, I'm so confused. How? What? I am actually just, just floored. I'm like, how are people already dead? Get some merch ling. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> these shitheads keep attacking me, man. Alright, I'm gonna have to fight these guys. Fight these guys hard, man. Alright.
All right. Well, we're gonna we're gonna kill you now. You brought this on yourself, Metator. You brought this on yourself. You know, this is the thing is in free for alls, guys. It's kind of like if you went to ancient days of warfare and stuff. Where, like, you can't afford to do this modern stuff. Where you're like, oh, you have war crimes and stuff. It's like, no, you've got to create fear so that people don't rise up. That's the only way you're going to maintain an empire, right? So, I'm just saying, I need to make an example right now, okay? Uh, hello? Unfortunately, that's a bit of a problem. <laughs> Okay. Damn, this guy's got good macro. How good is this guy? Feels like he's pretty high level. What the hell? What is going on right now? I don't know. <laughs> what? <laughs> It's I, it's so funny because StarCraft 2 1v1 is all about keeping your finger on the pulse of like what your opponent can do at each point in a game. And this is why if you're an expert 1v1 player, when you play 2v2s and all this sort of stuff, it is like an overwhelming experience. And free for all is that times a thousand because there's just so many different factions essentially all fighting for control over um, over what's going on. It's so crazy, man. Okay. All right, so we've got some corruptors we're building now. That's really important. All right, so we can now build those drones as well. All right, let's kill this gold base here. Gonna build a couple spines as well. I wanna go do a wee wee, so we're gonna send the corruptors over that way. We've got one one upgrades on the way. Is there a nexus there? Oh. I feel bad for Kromawa. Kromawa doesn't have many bases. That's the that's the natural. We'll leave Kromawa's natural. We'll come in and try and pee on the, the main base over here if possible. Interesting. I don't know whose those are, but some DTs just tried to run in my base. That's Steel Shadow. Man, everyone's attacking me! Why? I mean, we know why, I guess. <laughs> They were to remove the biggest threat, I guess. Let's let's uh, stroke my own ego, yeah. That's that's why for sure. Okay. Was that from Kromawa or someone else? I think that was from someone else, but anyways, I'm gonna do a wee wee. I think it, man, maybe it was Kromawa. Okay. Did we ever get Roach Speed? I don't think so. Let's get Hydrodan. Oh my lord. Um Okay. Oh man, these guys are dickheads. All right, I'm going to fall back here. Okay, okay. Where we, that's fine. That's fine. That happens. Alright, what is this? Bloody observer there. Alright, I definitely need this fourth in the back. Okay. 
Let's try and get this creep out so we have a bit more vision. And I really need that lurker den, man. And uh, that means hive tech as well. A few more corruptors would really help out as well. So we're gonna do. All right, try and get these rocks. Maybe I can come from that side. And what we're gonna do is we grab these guys and then. Oh my god, this map is so closed off on all these different angles, man. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to like okay flank around and there's like rocks blocking me on every side, dude. All right, we got some biles down. We lost two or three ravages, but we got three tanks. Well worth, well worth. Okay, okay, we got him. We got him. All right, this base is gonna go down. All right, we need more upgrades on these guys for sure. Let's get that one, get that. I gotta get rid of Metator. If I can get rid of Metator, we open up this whole corner of the map and, and suddenly we can, we can do so much more stuff, right? There's no tanks or anything. Yeah, this is good. All right, oh, this is awesome. Okay, I think we can get in here. Oh, we got him! We got him! Alright, alright, that's big, that's big, that's big. Quick, get rid of this fucking thing. <laughs> alright, GG. Alright, alright, cool, cool, cool. Alright, so we're gonna split these units up. Get another big round of drones in the back, because my work account kind of sucks right now. Let's get the hive going, we desperately need that. And then we can, um, we can kind of start getting the investor upgrades and all this sort of stuff as well. Trying to just work our way up to that uh, that final stage. And just trying to clear all these buildings out now because this all becomes my territory. So we get a fifth base here. And uh, I guess we can try to take this gold base and then these other bases will come down after that. And that'll be awesome if we can get that up. All right, so what we're gonna do, just surround my base with spores. Make sure there is like no drop path at all on this bottom side or anywhere else. And, okay, we can get double upgrades as well. Um, let's try and spread this creep out a little bit. And we can try and get that creep out on all sides. <laughs> Zerg's still alive. <laughs> let's try and send some Zerglings there. And my god, this map is massive! Absolutely insane. Okay, this this sicko. <gasps> Let's try and catch them when they pick up. After they load up, we're gonna jump in. Yep, check this out. So he loads up, he loads up, and then he gets one shot. Come on, one shot, one shot the prisms while they're full. While, while they're full, while they're full. Wait, damn it. He got out of there. Well done. All right, let's get, we're gonna get three vipers. Let's get the lurker upgrades. Um, let's try and make some, some of these. I'm gonna actually kill a bunch of my own ravages now just because I think they're really shitty supply. Uh, we're gonna get the Greatest Spire. And um, let's try and move these guys up here, shall we? Gonna try and take this base. So who's that? Okay. 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 <laughs> We desperately need these upgrades. Let's get Adrenal. All right. Okay, with the Lurkers there, we should be good. Trying to rebuild. A few more guys, though. Okay, yeah, yeah, the Lurkers are doing great. A few more Lurkers coming in right now. Okay, so we did get rid of that. Okay, okay. Very good, very good, very good. Oh, Steel Shadow's gonna... GG, that, that easily. GG, well played. I, I, I did not think that was it, but apparently... 
Oh, that's your last base. Okay, that we did not know. <laughs> Alright, that's gonna go up there. Um, okay. Okay, let's try and get some infestors. They're just gonna all go on the main army key, I think. Um, we're gonna send all the roaches off and let's pull back everything else. So the roaches are gonna finish clearing all this up and they're just gonna kind of go that way. Let's try and spread creep just so we have a bit more vision. Um, everywhere. <laughs> and yeah, more drones, more drones. We wanna keep that drone count a bit higher because we're gonna need the bank for sure. Um, can also just make sure we take all these hatcheries just to, to get the uh, upgrades and everything going there. Okay, gas is running out of that base. Uh, bean speed, adrenal glands, all the good stuff. All right. Break down those rocks too. All right. Trying to spread our creep out, get some more vision. Trying to see what the heck is going on on this gigantic map. Okay. Okay, creep, creep, creep. Just queuing up more tumors because there's so many different areas that they have to get to, right? All right, we see muters there. So I don't really know what's happening. Let's get um, Burrow as well. Try and put some changelings out. All right, yeah, those roaches doing real good. All right, here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> Fungal lurker combo, man. Oh my lord. Those were all filled with Archons, guys. Oh, shit, yeah. All right, all right, that's good, that's good. All right, we got mass BCs coming in. Not particularly surprising. This is why I'm not morphing broods. Until I see a really scary ground army, I think I'm gonna need Corruptors more than anything. Um. Oh my god. Well. Okay. Coming over here to deal with that. This army is going to pull back now. Okay, let's go. We got two of them. Okay, these bases will actually mine out. Got to be careful about that. Plus three. Okay, awesome. All right, we need more lurkers for sure. Uh, I think that's all of the vipers. Yeah, it is. Uh, still at 100 drones, which is not too bad. Okay, so check this out. We just put these guys on gas, and then we put those there, those there. Should be okay. Uh, let's go do some wee wees. So what we're gonna do is spread some changelings up here through the middle. Spread some creep. Okay. Yeah, that's a lot of stalkers. I wouldn't say stalkers are very good units for these scenarios, but 
It's okay. Okay, as Marines. Okay, so check this out. So we're going to do what we call the dickhead maneuver. It's where we morph a single broodlord and then just come in from behind and harass. Build one more infester. Yeah, that guy's going to be a real dickhead. Oh, there's an island there as well. Do you guys realize that? Oh, there's island bases. I didn't even know. Alright. Who do we take out? The right side or the left side? I feel like BCs are a pretty big threat. <laughs> he uses his teleport to get there, though. Alright. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah. It's going to kill every single one of these BCs so quick. So I have this like real small yet elite squad of units here that's just trying to trying to push him back. <laughs> get a little bit more space for myself. See what we can do here. Alright. Let's try and get that. Okay. Alright, you guys can go a few there, a few there. Maybe a few there as well. Yeah, yeah. That's the way of doing it. Alright. Ah, oh, man, how do I actually push someone, though? Alright, I think we got to take the top left out. Yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. Really just focus on that. I think that's a pretty good way to do it. Yeah. If we can get rid of Senju, that'll be huge. Take this base. Active Villain's trying to take it, though. Okay. And there's no way Activeling gets to keep this, that's for sure. Ah, oh, shit. Ah! Did I not tab there? Apparently not. Killed my own infestors. Okay. Let's go to his production. Come on, come on, come on. If we can get his production, then that'll be huge. All right, we got it. We got it. We got it. Let's go. We got it. We got it. We got it. GG. Oh. Oh. Let me take gold base. Okay, you go there, you go there. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, he hasn't GG'd. Keep that in mind. Anyway, so they're going to try and opportunistically strike strike me now. Which makes perfect sense. Um, and it's totally fine. If we can just... Okay. Active villain's going to get wiped. But I don't know about everything else. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, alright. Alright, alright. Yeah. Let's try and build some ultras just because they're more mobile right now. can go over here. I just don't want him mining out all the money, you know? That's the, the big thing that I'm mostly worried about. Oh, okay, yep. Yeah. We got enough broods. It's okay, it's okay. Okay. <laughs> uh. okay, that goes there. Uh. Okay, that means this one can go down here. Okay, you can go there. Go there. Uh, that base should still be there. Definitely don't know where my income's coming from right now. I don't even know where all my drones are, to be fair. Okay, all right, at least we're keeping those bases clear so they're not getting mined out. So that's like a money reserve for later in the game. Which I really need to worry about money because I don't have enough of it, guys. Okay, <laughs> that's a lot of stalkers, guys. This is Chromawa who's right here. So let's try and get over the edge. Get over the edge where he cannot blink me. <laughs> okay, he can't blink me here, so that's the uh, the spot to be in. It's actually an insane army size, though, right? So we're just building as many lings as we can, simply for ease of movement. I don't think Senju ever left, guys, as well. We've got to be worried about that. But we've got a new gold base there. He's going to take out some of these hatcheries, but he's going to lose a lot of stalkers doing it. Okay. 
Okay, drop that. Oh my god, can you die? <laughs> I don't have enough supply to build enough units to kill all this stuff at once. I'm just like, Jesus. Let's try and take some hatcheries up here, by the way. Alright, that can go there. This can go here. And these guys can come back here. Alright, they're all attacking me, man. I mean, no one's building air right now, so... That is... That is definitely, uh... Going okay for me. Okay. Building ultras right now. Gonna finish off Kromawa down on this side. Gonna fungal an ultra and miss because I'm super pro. It doesn't slow their movement speed, but yeah. Okay. So I've lost all my mining. That's rough. Uh, but I think it's all right. So I'm just gonna attack to the top left of the map. See what's going on over there. Uh, let's try and get more energy. And I think it's really important I rebuild my drones as well. Okay, so the Broodlords can go there, and we're going to try and defend this side with Ultras and Infestors, and um, see kind of what we can do here. This is a crazy amount of units. What is... This is insane. He's on pure Stalker as well. Oh my god, this alliance as well of all of them trying to gank me, man. Holy crap. Problem is, I just don't have any lava anymore as well. Oh, those are some big fungals, though. Oh, we just killed a lot of stalkers, which is awesome. All right. I mean, we lose, we lose all of that, but at least we're killing his whole base. And getting rid of Kromawa is causing me a lot of troubles, of course. All right, we're building lots of ultras. I'm trying to build as many drones as I can. And we're going to try and build a lot of different hatcheries now as well. Just so I have production, right? Oh! Oh, that's good. That's a good angle. Okay, so... I'm losing all my production just because Stalker base trade. Oh, so annoying. Oh, my God. Leave! Okay, so we need... Just basically to... Get some patrolling units. Oh, we lost my infestation pit. That's what's happened. Like, Why can't I build infestors right now, man? Okay. Oh, my lord. My uh, bank is getting really low, guys. Having four people attack you constantly really does uh, hurt. Not being able to rebuild those really hurts as well. Alright, 
Alright, we got some lurkers on the way. And a whole bunch of infestors now. Can I protect any economy, I wonder? At this point, I'm counterattacking with anything I can. I lost my hive. Oh, that's a big, that's a big problem. More ultras. Okay, we're splitting up units everywhere. These brood lords are going to start working through there. This is going to go there. Oh my god, there's too many attack warnings everywhere, man. Wait, wait, wait. Is that? Okay. Oh, B there's still BCs up for Senju. Alright, we're going to build a big cat pack of Corruptors. We're going to go hunt those down. Okay, Infesta, Ultra Broodlord, and the, the Viper Corruptor is going to move up there. And we can just take this base and make some drones there. We're on 29 drones, so I'm trying to rebuild the economy. It's just not really getting up right now. You can't escape. You can only run so far, mate. You're cornering yourself. It's gonna have to fight soon enough. See how much you can recall.
Parasitic bomb fungal combo. Ultras are clearing out his tech. Rebuilding drones. My brain hurts right now. Putting guys back on gas. Back on gas. A few guys on minerals. A few guys on minerals. That base still has a good amount of minerals. Take it. That base still has a good amount of minerals. I am out of cash, for those who don't know. And, uh, creates quite the situation. We've got some lurkers spread around my bases, which are going to be big. Um, every base that's left is huge. Send the broodlords over that way. What do we got up here? Oh, you're such a piece of shit. Oh my god. Okay, so we'll send a few ultras up there to at least defend some of these bases. Um, send those there. Broodlords are going to push into his production even more, and his extra bases wherever they are. I don't know where the Nidus Worm is. Okay, that, that's it. Yeah, yeah, If we can get rid of that Nidus Worm. And we've got four or five Ultras waiting up here, which is awesome. Okay, that's really good, guys. Um, yeah. Ultra will take all this out as well. Okay, Broodlords are going to pull back just in case they get caught out, uh, as will the Infestors. Still got gold mining there. We've got gold mining here. Um, I think we can recover from all of that. Run, run, run. That's our base, mate. Get a few more drones on those minerals as well. Gonna have to start focusing on efficiency really badly because we can't rebuild after all of that bank. Um, I think these are his last buildings, guys. I don't think he has any drones out, so I think he realizes that. And we can eliminate him. Awesome. Okay, you go there. Check it out. We've got ultras here. Um, he's got some roaches, but if we bring that up there as well, where are your last buildings, mate? Okay, take these two hatcheries again. I think that might be his last building, by the way. Oh, that's his last building. It's revealed. It's revealed. And it's going to stop fighting back in a moment. Yep. His units won't fight back now. It's been eliminated. All right. We got Activillain out. All right. Now we just got to figure out kind of what the hell everyone's actual army is. And uh, a few drones there. We're on 42 workers right now. Uh, we can also get some workers long distance mining that. And this base is, of course, super healthy. So... Who we got left in here, guys? Is it just ran out? Who the... Wait. Have we fought at all? Did you have the muters earlier? Because we're the cross map from each other, right? <laughs> I don't even know what this player has because we haven't fought at all all game. <laughs> Good luck, mate. Let's go. All right, I have no idea what his army looks like or anything, um, obviously. Oh, he's stalkers and... Oh, okay. That's going to be a nice, easy fight for me. You know what? We're going to send a few... Uh, we're going to send the ultras off. 
we're gonna send the ultras off to go base trade a little bit with them like kill some of the expansions and stuff um see what they can do yeah that army should be pretty easy for me to kill my corrupt accounts a little low i think that's the big thing that i'm most worried about here um oh hello no 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 We're gonna just click a whole bunch of lings up here. Ultras are starting to tear up the production a little bit, which is good. Okay. Lurkers are gonna kill that star. Got that whole army down. They weren't even on a move. <laughs> Bit of an anticlimactic finish, but I'll take it. After weathering the storm that this game has been, guys. Oh, oh, he's on move command again. Oh no, run out of gas. Oh. Ah! Oh, okay, okay. Alright, I think the Lings can kill everything now, guys. I think just mass Ling is, is where it's at. Man, how many times have I, I lost my bases, though, in this top side of the map? I swear, it's actually crazy. Just how many times? Alright, we'll build another round of drones for that one. Try and get this one up as well. See, denying that Senju's mining up here, like, I did actually keep a bunch of fresh bases available. I never got to take them because I got ganked. But, like, the fact that I still have resources that are nearby saved up. This base as well, which I kept fighting over, it does actually mean that we do have more money available to us. And, uh... Holy crap, though, dude. My brain, like, hurts from everything that's happening in this game. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh! One more fungal. Get in, get in! Quick, unzip your fly! Unzip your fly! Pee on everything! GG, well played, mate. Oh, my lord! Oh, my god. Oh, my god. Ah! We won! I won! I forgot to use this island as well, by the way. I completely forgot about this island. I should have been droning up that this whole time. Oh, my god. Platonic altar? I think it's called Platonic Altar, guys, because it's if you are someone who is basically, um, you know, either an incel or um, just, you know, maybe you choose to be celibate for whatever reason, you know, you want to be only in platonic relationships. Well, this is the sort of game that you play. And a free-for-all map that big, that is that intense, that goes for, like, usually probably hour-long games. <laughs> He's like, it's Plutonic, not Platonic. Oh, 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 I'm sorry. Is that where you're a virgin, but you're on the planet Pluto or some shit? It's the exact same thing. Exact same thing. Anyway, point being, this is the free-for-all map you play when you're definitely never going to feel the touch of a woman. I mean, any any romantic feeling of people you're interested it's not going to happen. This is the map you play. You get on here with the boys, with your girls. You pay eight player free-for-all, goes for several hours, and this is where you get your relationships going because... You're gonna have drama. You're gonna you're gonna create alliances. Alliances are gonna break down. They're gonna take half. They're gonna be like, active villain. I want half. I want half active villain. And then fucking they start backstabbing each other. And that's probably the only thing that kept me alive in that game is I think they all started their marriages started breaking down and they started arguing over who gets who gets to oh I get to take that base. No 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 half of that base should be mine. You know it, it's a whole thing. Um. 
<laughs> a platonic relationship is where your personality is so radioactive that no one wants to get near. <laughs>